How much froth is my hardcore Iron Man which cannot leave PvP worlds? The account got one major goal and that is obtaining an infernal cape. This series could end at any point and the current bounty is on screen. Good luck gamers. It's come to my attention that it's too difficult for the hunters to find me when I'm playing with Private Off. So I'm gonna test something out this week. We're gonna do Private On weekend. Saturday and Sundays we play with Private On and we'll see how it goes. I have decided what I wanna do. Big Chompy Bird Hunting. This quest is useful for Morning's End Part 1. Oh, there we go. Big Chompy Bird Hunting completed. I thought this quest was actually longer. Happy to have completed it. Nice. Alright, time to do a quest. Sheep Herder. Here we go. Sheep Herder, one of the worst quests in the game. I've made two of them stuck. There we go. Thank God. Took me ages. There we go. Sheep Herder completed. I think that's all we need for Morning Sand Part 1. Where is it? Morning Sand Part 1. All requirements done. Alright, time to start Morning Sand Part 1. Oh shit, wait. I'm in here. <gasps> I got teleport crystal already. I actually only wanted the teleport crystal. I didn't actually want to complete the quest, but this quest was actually easier than I thought. There we go. Morning Sand Part 1 completed. What the hell? You can you can enter hardcore's houses now. Uh, I don't know, man. I don't know. <laughs> I actually think Batman City, who just invaded my house, just wanted to decorate my walls in my POH using this blade. And luckily for all of us, this blade happens to be today's video sponsor. This plate is the 21st century's way to put art on your wall. This plate is a metal poster designed to capture your unique passions. Whether you like movies, animals or landscapes, there will be a unique design just for you. Mounting a display plate on a wall is super easy, no tools are required, you just put a sticker on the wall, then you place the magnet on this sticker and it's done. I personally got three display plates on my wall, I got a lion, I got a mountain and I got a runescape map as well. And for every display sold, one tree is planted in Africa. And if you purchase this plate using my link, you get 26% discount if you buy one or two and 36% discount if you buy three or more. The discount will automatically be applied if you use my link in the description down below. So I want to unlock some more teleport crystals here. And the only way to get them is by killing elf warriors over here. Ooh, we got a crystal teleport seed. Yo, another one, back to back. All right, here we are. Hey, I only got three teleport crystals. Like people might figure out that I'm tel using these teleports before I even use them up, so. Oh, there we go, 31, Slayer. There we go, task completed, horrible task. It's in multi. All right, another Slayer task. Gold. Today is a Saturday and I'm uh, feeling generous today to the hunters. So we're gonna try to play with private on completely. And we're gonna see what happens. Way 66 hit points. All right, there we go. 32 Slayer. And that's gonna be the task completed. There we go. At first, I didn't really like cave crawlers, but they do drop some solid herbs. So I, I actually do like them now. All right, it should be the last kill. And a Slayer level, 33 Slayer. And the task completed. Oh no, look at it. Oh, <laughs> we got some house intruders. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I have been scouted. All right, I should probably teleport, right? This is 34 Slayer, and there we go, 7th one range. That is 1300 total level as well. This account just keeps going up. And that's the task completed. We get four points. Whoa, Ralph, 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 Ralph. Oh, damn. <laughs> He was waiting. I think this is a broken bot, but I'm not sure. I'm not gonna report it. I'm not gonna snitch on him. I'm gonna let him be. Do it. Let him do his own thing. You know. Is he gonna be here again? Ah, uh, we can get our slayer task. Beautiful. Ogres. 
Or do you kill ogres? All right, uh, ogres. If someone teleblocks me, my escape is this one. 35 Slayer. Okay, honestly, this ogre spot is so good, actually. This is so close to an escape. And it's in the middle of nowhere. People are always expecting me to hide in a dungeon or on a roof or something like that. But no, we're on the ground, just in the middle of nowhere. 36 Slayer. All right, this is my first long bone out of many. Uh, thank you, Mr. Ogre. This should be the level, yep, here we go, 37 Slayer, beautiful. This ogre right here, it's stuck, it can't leave this area. Alright, that's gonna be the task completed, let's go. 74 farming, beautiful. Alright, we are running through multi to get myself a Vanica Slayer task and... Uh, oh, no one was here. Cave Slimes. And that's another slay task completed. Yep, task completed. From a safe zone too. <laughs> run! 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 56 cooking. 73 mining while editing. Thank you. You only make money by spending money. Here I am buying nature rooms. We're gonna high out for some cash. Alright, time to make some money. The cash tag is just gonna go up. I'm rich again, 299k. So I wanna upgrade my shield to a maple shield for that extra magic defense. And to get that 57 fletching, we're gonna do mithril bolts and darts. 56 smithy. Alright, this might be one of the last mithril bars. We have now made 328 mithril bars. Uh, should be enough for a while. But I'm not gonna make them into darts or bolts anytime soon. Uh, we're gonna do something else. I think we're going back to Slayer, our 10th task for some points. <sighs> I think that's, yep, yeah, task 9 completed. One more task to go until we get some points. Alright, we're taking the long way around to Vanica. I'm scared of taking the Edgeville dungeon. I guess no one's here then. Rock slugs, we got rock slugs task again. Beautiful. There we go, 38 Slayer, Virus coming out kill. Look at that, I got the rare Mystic Gloves. Never gonna be useful ever, but it's rare. And as a content creator, you have to tell everyone about every rare drop you get. All right, this is gonna be the last kill. How much points do we actually get from 10 tasks? 20 points given. All right, we have 62 points now. Wait, who's that? Is that someone waiting for me? Probably not. Die noob. Oh, he is looking for me, but he's AFK. Another 10k experience, thank you. Second time enchanting these teleports, all right. I guess no one really finds this spot. The longer people don't know about this teleporting method, the better. Watching my window in case there's any house invaders coming in here. Another task, dogs. I haven't played for so many days, I'm still private on apparently. 39 Slayer, task completed. Alright, I now have the level to do a quest, the Slayer level. We have all the requirements to start A Taste of Hope. So the reason why I want to complete A Taste of Hope is for the Draken's Medallion. This medallion provides me unlimited teleports to a safe bank in Mauritania. I honestly think I need my stats up. This is horrible. I can barely hit anything. I ended up not killing the boss, so I will have to upgrade my gear and get my stats up. Look at that, Dragon Impling, thank you very much. I recorded a square. Can we get a clue scroll? Dragon dart tips. All right, I'm back to killing the undead druids. We need grubby keys for Saradom and Bruce. One in 10 drop chance, once you get a key. Whoa, a grubby key. Woo, another grubby key. All right, we got two chances of Saradom and Bruce from the grubby chest, here's number one. We got shark. Please give us the Bruce. All right, we got restores. I'm not gonna complain about restores. Egg potatoes, no sharks. Ah, uh, could have been much better, but I'll take that. Time for a little break. We're gonna start thieving. We need some uh, GP maybe. I got 64 thieving. And there we go, 65 thieving. All right, I think that's enough thieving for today. 34K cash made. Another Slayer task completed. There we go, 13 tasks completed. Task 14 completed. 57 strength. I completely forgot these drop the giant keys. All right, I'll take it. There we go, task completed. We got four more points. Any pets? 
It's never lucky. Okay, gotta make some emerald rings. Uh, we are out of dual rings. I was planning to complete Monkey Madness to get those quick combat levels. But then I got to a part in the quest where there's a 10 second delay in multi. Where you can't teleport, you can't move. And if you get tile blocked, you can't escape. And for this reason, I decided to not complete Monkey Madness. And I probably will never complete it as well. Alright, quick little break from questing to do this. Make some bolts. Surely he doesn't have an account for me, and surely he's not looking for me. He's looking at, okay, he's looking at me through the window. He says, hi, C engineer. All right. This is very suspicious. Why would he say hi? 55 watching. Since I'm in Edge and no one's here, I, th I figured I'd just go and do some crazy archaeologist. Uh, Silver War. I'm going for the obvious upgrade, a room crossbow. I currently have a metal crossbow, which is pretty much all I need currently. My escape, if someone teleports me, it's running up north instead of south, getting some aggros on Ankus and just wait out the TB and teleport. Prayer potion. Actually good. Can stay here longer. Ugh, I, I just hate the process of buying runes. Okay, Jagex, humble request to end this grind right here. Nope. How about this one? Surely. A long bone, really. I asked this guy to f wait, what? Can he one hit me? Probably not. He TB'd me! He's dead. <laughs> cannonballs. These cannonballs are not useful at all on this type of account because you can't use a cannon on PvP world. Alright, after this kill I'm officially over drop rate of a rune crossbow. Never lucky, officiale. Yeah, never lucky. Alright, this is 7th one. Oh shit. Yeah, 7th one magic. I got a combat level, 67 combat, 67 HP, red dehyde body. There is the upgrade I needed uh, one month ago. Kill count number 50, we are officially on the high scores. Look at our what we got. Nothing. Alright, the high scores have officially been updated. And if you go to the bottom, I am rank 486 on the high scores. I'm officially on the high scores for crazy archaeologists. So any kills moving forward, people just might be there waiting for me. I have a good feeling. 7 to 1 kill count. Another longbone. I had a very bad feeling. It's supposed to be 1 in 25 apparently. Ah! Whoa, I didn't see what I got. Who was that? He was waiting for me too. <sighs> but he splashed the TV. That's what happens when I go dry. Everyone will know what I'm doing and now people are onto me. They know I still haven't gotten that rune crossbow. All right, I'm out of prayer potions. We are back to the EFK spot. Uh, there we go, a Rainer. Another Rainer. Rainer, double Rainer. All right, I think that's enough Rainers. We got 11. Total. Have I seriously gotten three long bones from the crazy archaeologist? All right, private on. That's what happened at Zora. I got dry at Zora, then I died. That's the exact exact same thing is about to happen here. I'm gonna go dry, and then I'm gonna die. <gasps> I got it. The the kill I got, private on. I got the rune crossbow. <laughs> That's all we need. Oh my god. Oh my. Goodness, goodness gracious. What are the chances? Oh my god, someone came running, but we have the rune crossbow. Oh my god, finally. Finally, it happened. 88 kill count. That's all we needed for the rune crossbow. And I'm done with this crazy grind. And that is where we're gonna wrap up today's episode. And just before you leave, I do have a dream. And that dream is hitting 10,000 likes on this specific video. So if you want my dream to come true, give this video a like and I will see you guys hopefully next week. Goodbye. Oh yeah, one more thing. We got a massive 5 mil donation from Sir Donut. Putting the bounty at 7,505 million. Mm -hmm.